Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. In today's video, we have one very interesting radical puzzle. Here we have to evaluate 3a plus 3b plus 3c. Once given equation is cube root a plus cube root b plus cube root c equal to cube root of cube root 2 minus 1. So in other words, we can say we have to write our RHS in terms of sum of three cube roots. So let's try to proceed this by considering RHS equal to x. So I will be writing x is equal to cube root of cube root 2 minus 1. Now let me consider this cube root 2 separately as y. Let me write here, let cube root 2 equal to y. So I can write y cube will be 2. Here I will write cube root of, this is y minus 1. This is x. Consider cubing both sides. I can write x cube will be equal to y minus 1. So two important results, x cube is equal to y minus 1 and y cube is equal to 2. Now I will consider algebraic manipulation steps. Can we write 1 as 2 minus 1? Yes, we can write. Now if you will see what is 2, 2 is y cube. So let me write here y cube is equal to 2. Known and x cube equal to y minus 1. Okay, so I will be writing 1 is equal to y cube minus 1. Now a cube minus b cube formula is on. Let me apply 1 equal to a minus b, so y minus 1 in other bracket. a square plus b square plus ab, so I will be writing now. Again, one algebraic manipulation is step. y minus 1 as it is, we will write x cube. Now, this bracket can be multiplied with 3. So, 3y square plus 3y plus 3. So, I need to divide also. Now, this 3 I will split 2 plus 1. y minus 1, 3y square plus 3y plus 2 plus 1. This is our 3 divided by 3. Now 2 we can write it is y cube. So let me write y minus 1 is x cube. And here by 3 and then I will write this bracket 3y square plus 3y. In place of 2 I can write y cube. 1 is 1 cube. Now you can see a cube plus b cube plus 3a square b plus 3ab square. So this bracket is the formula of y plus 1 whole cube. So left hand side is 1, right hand side is x cube times y plus 1 whole cube divided by 3. Let me write here x cube y plus 1 whole cube divided by 3 or I can write x cube value from here this will be 3 over y plus 1 whole cube or I can write y plus 1 value also this will be equal to cube root 3 divided by x we will use directly. Now I will consider the second algebraic manipulation. A step that will be 3 I can write 2 plus 1. Okay. So 3 will be as it is. 2 is our y cube plus 1. 2 was y cube. Now I will apply a cube plus b cube formula in our RHS. So I can write 3 equal to a plus b. So y plus 1. See this value. Times 
a square minus ab plus b square. Now we know that 2 is equal to y cube, so y is equal to cube root 2, original substitution. For the second bracket, this bracket is, we can easily find out using cube root 2 equal to y. Now what about y plus 1? So here we will write cube root 3 over x. So let me write 3 equal to cube root 3 over x and then bracket was y square minus y plus 1 considering y is equal to cube root 2. Now I can divide both sides by 3. I will cross multiply. I will take x to the LHS. So let us write x will be equal to cube root 3 divided by 3 times y square minus y plus 1. So I can write here cube root 3 over 3. Let me write 3 power 1 over 3 and in denominator it is 3. Let me write y square. It will be cube root 2 whole square minus y cube root 2 plus 1. So using exponent property I can write 3 power 1 over 3 minus 1 and in bracket I will be writing cube root 4 minus cube root 2 plus 1. Property used here is a power b whole power c. Any time we can consider a power c whole power b here. And for a power b over a power c, any time we can write a power b minus c, which I have applied here. So in total it is left 3 raised to the power minus 2 over 3 times this bracket cube root 4 minus cube root 2 plus 1. Let me write 3 raised to the power minus 2 by 3 in bracket cube root 4. Then it was cube root 2. Then it was plus 1. This was our x. Now I can write 1 over 3 raised to the power 2 and then can we write power 1 by 3 and bracket is cube root 4 minus cube root 2 plus 1. Yes. So it is in denominator cube root 9. Here I can write cube root 4 minus cube root 2 plus 1. Now let us use distributive law. I can write this as cube root 4 divided by cube root 9 minus cube root 2 divided by cube root 9 plus cube root 1 can we write divided by cube root 9. Now I can club numerator and denominator radical terms. So I can write cube root 4 over 9 minus cube root 2 over 9 plus cube root 1 over 9. Let me write cube root 4 over 9 minus cube root 2 over 9 plus cube root 1 over 9. Now one point is missing. See this minus sign. So I will take into the radical term. So I can write cube root 4 over 9 plus cube root minus 2 over 9 plus cube root 1 over 9. Now I can easily compare our LHS. It was cube root A plus cube root B plus cube root c. So either of the value we can consider a, b, c. What we have to find out that is our expression 3a plus 3b plus 3c. So let me write here 
expression equal to t and i will take three common so in bracket a plus b plus c so i will be adding all the radicands written so let me write three times 4 over 9 plus b b is negative minus 2 over 9 plus c 1 over 9 so from here i can write three times denominator is same so i need to simply add 4 minus 2 and plus 1 so 4 plus 1 5 minus 2 3 over 9 so expression e will be 3 times 3 over 9 or i can write 9 over 9 so our final answer becomes e equal to 1 and this brings the end of this video do not forget to like share and subscribe friends bye bye till next video good luck take care of yourself bye bye